All right, here we are, possibly the last ride on my Honda CB500X. Well, hello there. Hey, how you doing? You having a good day? You want to join me and hunt some crawfish? I came here to hunt some crawfish. This place is pretty covered up in crawfish. Although I don't see any today. You may call them crawdads, but I call them crawfish. But wait! We're not here to do crawfish hunting. Bun dun dun! We're here for a bike reveal, man. And after two months of researching and deliberating, I've decided to trade the Honda CB500X in. And the two biggest contenders were the FZ07 and FZ09, as I mentioned before in earlier videos. So last night, um, I got off work a little early and I said, I'm going to go up there and talk to him about it. And lo and behold, I bought a motorcycle. Here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Back reveal. You are correct, sir. That is not an FZ07 or 09. That is a 2015 Yamaha WR 250R R, blah, 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 a lot of R's. All that doesn't mean that it's super sport though. <sighs> yeah, totally different direction. Why? I don't know. <laughs> Insurance for one, full coverage on this baby for a year is a hundred bucks. On the SD09, it's about like 700 something bucks. Big difference. Also, I've thought long and hard the last couple of days about what kind of rider I want to be. And I decided that I want to go try more of the Enduro off-roading. I've never done that in my life, so I think I really would like to try it. I think I would learn a lot about motorcycle riding in general by riding off-road for a while. You know, once I decided that I was going dual sport, I immediately went to the Honda CRF 250L. I really attracted me based for a couple of the reasons. One, price point. And two, it was a Honda. <laughs> but however, when I started doing my research and I found out this bike, even though it cost uh, almost two grand more, was much more value bang for the buck. Mainly because the inverted forks the larger suspension and travel, and the better chassis. The dealership that I bought it from, they actually said they have a group of guys going this Sunday and invited me to go. So I want to go and tag along and be that guy that holds them up. Because <laughs> I've never done it before. I wonder if I can drive through that. I wonder if I can drive over that, up there. Not today, maybe later. Maybe later. I think I'm going to be real happy with this bike. That's why I chose it. So, for all of my subscribers who are True Blue CB500X fans, um, I still love you. I hope you stay with me in my quest. Um, I love that bike, the CB500X, uh, but it was time for me to do go in a different direction. Um, just where I'm at right now in my life. Anyway, enough of the bullshit. Let's go ride. Why are you talking like this?